We're in Woodcourse Park in Highton, one of the many great parks within Knowsley. And sadly, a couple of years ago, the National Wildflower Centre was closed its doors. Uh, what we want to do now from a Knowsley Council point of view is bring a lot of our key partners to uh, set up offices and set up their facilities in the National Wildflower Centre grounds and bring it back to its former glory. So we've got one Knowsley, former Knowsley CVS. We've got the Friends of Course A Park and Incredible Edibles, a, a, a gardening charity who grow their own vegetables, uh, educate the young people about growing their own vegetables and bring the community groups in and get their hands dirty basically. And so we want to utilise the site again for everybody. Just walking around the park for half an hour is good for your mental health, for your fitness, you know, and you do feel better once you've visited the park. And so we want to encourage as many activities on, in the park and bring as many people in. Well, there's not much funding and that's why it's very important that we all work together. And for instance, say like the Friends can access funding which the council can't, we can support the Friends in getting that funding. And the same with One Nosley, Incredible Edibles. So if we all work together and pool our funding, we can make a success of it. So One Nosley, we're looking to um, potentially relocate to this space, our offices, and um, take on space to enable our local sector to come together, to meet, to work together. Um, and also importantly for the rest of our sector to have a space that enables Bulls, um, the development of community-led enterprise within the borough. There's stuff here that we, we want to secure and protect and maintain and the potential for new stuff to come into this space and it will be a very natural ecosystem of community-led activity, enterprise and the community support and the community alongside our other key partners within the local authority and from the private sector as well potentially.